All right, so welcome to a, another unfortunate video. Now, I came home and this is what I found. And this is right under the shower upstairs. So I'm thinking it might be the, the problem with the pipe right up there. So um, I'm about to check to see exactly why and where this water is coming from to see if it's something I can do or if I have to call somebody to do it for me. All right, so I check upstairs like everywhere to see, you know, if uh, it was coming from the side of the walls, but um, it appears that that wasn't the case. Um, so I'm I'm gonna have to cut the the sheetrock up there um, so I can look to see if this, I think it's a small leak because I turn all the waters on um, so far. I don't see anything coming as if it was like a big old leak. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut it over here and, um, and go from there. <laughs> problem is actually all the way and there it's very dark up there is my light uh, let's see if I can show y'all I think the problem is all the way down there I can't see it yet but it's coming from down there so I need to cut the sheet rack a little bit more that way I can see exactly where you see the water starts right over there you see it so i need to see exactly where the water is coming from oh boy i hope it's not something real bad i thought it was over here but the problem is right here it's the the red hose right here it seems like that has a, a hole it's over here there's a there's a hole right here. You see how the water keep on coming from right here? So this is where our problem is. See, I got the water running so I can double check. Like over here, you see, when I do this, and right there, it fill up again. When I do this, cause the holes is right in the back right here. And that's why the water circulate here. This was just the lowest point and over here as well. So the water was just trying to find, a, you know, somewhere to get out. So I have to do something with this tube from over here to here. All right, so I went and purchased this. So let me see if it, this will actually work. I'm not even sure if this will work, but um, let me put it in and see if it actually will work. I already mark, let me show you. E Right here, I'm gonna cut the two inches right over here. I'm going to cut it so I can uh, put the slip in and first, make sure it's locked and then push the other part in. So we'll see how that goes. It is very important to read the instructions. So make sure you enter the slip end first and enter it all the way to where it actually stop. And then you enter the other side and you lock it in. All right, so I have my wife turn everything on upstairs. Um, the hot water is running right now cause I can feel it's hot. And look at that, nothing is coming out. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I think I may have fixed the issue. Well, there you have it, guys. Now, this is just me um, taking out the old screws so I can drywall the, um, the ceiling. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. That way you don't miss any of our future videos.